Welcome back. 743 right now, and look at the sun is shining in yeah. Miami. We Passing are on the, the road this morning. Don't they look great? Yes. <laughs> they do. I'm wondering if we can see their breath out there. Jamie and Danielle, you guys look a little chilly out there. Is that what you're doing up and down? Well, it's oh, better. It's getting listen, better. Listen, what did I just tell you I did? I shed a layer, which means that it's getting warmer. <laughs> <laughs> like a snake, I'm shedding my layers and peeling. But I have to tell you, being out here has been so amazing. And not far from here has got to be, I'd have to say, one of the really great experiences of my professional career in terms of doing something I've never done before. It's probably only about a mile down less, the road, right? Less, less yeah, than a mile down yeah, the road. We're talking about uh, Port, uh, the uh, Port of Miami. Port of Miami. A government cut, and there's a fishing captain there in the harbor. Who there. is amazing, captain Jamie. Bouncer Smith. And, and, and this guy is. Is a legacy type fisherman here in South and Florida. You actually, Everyone you're knows Bouncer. I mean, you, would, you I always did. talk about oh, God, it. Yeah, well, there's a publication called Florida Sports yeah. Magazine that I love to read. It's, mm -hmm. it's gone from about that thick now to that thick because of the internet, so they've sure. back production. Sure. But Bouncer always had an article in there each and every month, a tip uh, here in South Florida on how to catch this fish or that fish. And for me to actually meet him and for mm -hmm. you to see me, me seeing you meeting him yes. and catching a fish with this guy yes. was outstanding. And I have to tell you, one of the more warm hearted, gregarious, knowledgeable people that you will ever, ever have the chance yep. to meet. So knowledgeable, I actually caught a fish. Let's take a look. <laughs> something large. In English, what he said was, <laughs> we're going fishing. I still thought you put little worms. You don't put worms on them? No worms. What do you no use? Worms. We're using live, we're using live, live, live bait. How so. excited are you to be out here on the I'm, water? I'm excited for you guys. Okay. You know, I've done this my whole life. Yeah. So, and you have not. I've never, ever, ever. San Francisco. I am. <laughs> <laughs> this is my own stomping ground. Okay. Here, so I'm happy that you're out here Aww. enjoying this. Well, I'm glad I'm out here to see you enjoy this. This is really awesome. I'm really excited about it. I want to some fish to my mouth. Let's do it. This is a picture right underneath the boat. You see how it's going along? Your That's a fish right there. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else in the world that you can imagine yourself doing? Um, at no stage in my life could I think of doing anything else. Oh. When I was... Fish on, fish on, fish on. Fish. Danielle. Yes, you get it, Jamie. Danielle, you come here. No, no. <laughs> you, you. <laughs> come here. Right hand above the Okay. Throat. Yep. Okay. Your waist. Right here. Fanny pack. Well, your right yep. hand down right okay. there. Keep that you line go. tight. Keep your rod tip up. Right on your fanny with that line. Keep your rod tip up. Start, re start reeling. Crank on him. Keep the, Keep the rod tip up. Up, 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 up. Right there is good. There you go. You got a D. Get him, girl. Woo. Woo. No, keep going. You got him. You got him. Annette? Yeah. Yeah, good idea. I think it's a barracuda. Oh. Watch the motors. A Watch the motors. There, get by the motors. All right, there you go. Thank you. A little lower. A little lower. A little lower. Keep winding. Keep winding. Just keep the rod lower right okay. in front of you. Barracuda? Yeah. Keep winding. Keep winding. Keep winding. Keep winding. Put the rod down first. Yeah. Barracuda. Dude, look at the teeth. Look at the choppers on the thing. Yeah. Can I just tell you that is work? That oh, was you, work. You ought to see a hundred pound tarpon when you do that for an hour. Oh. <laughs> So, your arm's still hurting? Uh, yes. <laughs> and you know what I think happens? My competitive juices just started flowing, and I wanted, to, got him. I wanted to get that barracuda in there, and I got him in there, and it was...
was overwhelming for me. It was like, now I, I get it, right? I get why people love fishing. It is amazing. I had such a great time. And seeing how happy you were for me yeah. was really kind of special. I sounded like my father when I was a kid. He, 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 he's always, yeah. Keep the rod tip up, man. Don't horse him. Don't horse yeah. him. Because that's when you pull the hook and lose the fish. But you did a fine job, my I friend. I love that. You. That I was so it. much fun. So memorable for me. And the weather worked out for us, The too. weather worked out great for yes. us. Yeah, it's so working it's out working now. out great for us right now <laughs> okay. as well. Let's work. Here comes the I'm going to peel another layer while you do weather. Okay, okay go ahead. Okay. Take it off. Not all, but take that jean. <laughs>